Hey folks, so this is just a super, super quick video as an addition to the reverb ducking tutorial that I put out recently. A couple of people have messaged to say that they would have liked to have seen the basics of how these effect sends were set up. So I've stripped it back and this is absolutely from the beginning. So I've got a track here and I've literally just got a vocal. Sounds like this. No effects on that at all. And I've just spaced it out a bit put some gaps in there so that we can hear the reverb in the gap. So now I'm going to do a new effects track. On that track, I'm going to put good old Valhalla Vintage Verb. I'll pull the decay back just a little bit. And from the vocal, I'm going to now go to the sends and I'm going to send to that effects channel. So if I pull that down to zero, I'll play the track. Till it's in my head, take it all away. And as I pull that up, we'll get more reverb. So I'm gonna light it up just like a cigarette smoke Till it's in my head, take it all away Now, obviously, that is a enormous amount of reverb and I probably wouldn't have anything like that much in an actual mix. But just to show you how this is set up, I'm really going to overcook it. Now, we need to go back to the effects channel and put a compressor in. I'm going to use the stock Cubase compressor, but any compressor with a sidechain input will be fine. Activate the sidechain. And now here's the important bit. We need to send from that same vocal to the sidechain input on that compressor. And if I turn that on, what we should see is when the vocal sings, we get gain reduction here. So I'm gonna light it up just, just gonna lower the threshold a bit. Till it's in my head, take it all away So I'm gonna light it up just So you can really hear there That when the vocal is present We get this enormous amount of gain reduction On only the reverb So you hear the reverb ducking out the way Of the vocal And then filling in The gaps where there's no vocal present Till it's in my head, take it all away So I'm gonna light it up just Now, that's obviously very extreme But if I was to pull this back so that we've got a more normal amount of reverb Light it up just Like a cigarette smoke Till it's in my head, take it all away And I've just raised the threshold on the compressor so we're not getting so much gain reduction, you should be able to hear how we can just subtly move that reverb out the way when the vocal's there and let it come back when the vocal has space around it. And following on from this basic setup video, you can learn some more advanced techniques for how you would employ this kind of sidechain processing from my original reverb ducking tutorial video. Hope that's helpful guys. Till next time.